as you now have three players on red four, excuse me, on red right now, as that's only one droning, and Maestro is going to kind of play out. But just like that, Kronos is going to take out Onyx. No refrag coming on that long angle straight into Cigar. Maslow taking out Devil. That's Baze left in piano after he's gotten the main wall in bathroom. Piano. And with the defenders rotating around 12 seconds left, it's going to be a strong plant here. And just like that, Vertigo is going to take out Bezu. Can't get the refrag onto him. And the diffuser's nowhere to be found. They're going to try and go for kills, but can't quite close it out. As Mazo's just going to hide, which is a smart play here. And first round is going to go to Nuisance after a pretty solid hold there in what looked like almost just kind of a disconjointed attack by him. knows he's right around the corner from him. I don't think he knows does he not know and Rhodes gonna take out devil and then just like that Maslow is gonna take out Onyx by buys you immediately trades back onto Rhodes but then a double kill here coming from Maslow onto easy right at the bottom of red stairs and just like that it's just Shad and buys you left you know not even really on the first floor even in a place to assault off on the second not even getting the default cam yet Trying to make that play through. Freezer can't quite connect the shots. He is going to almost down Kronos, but can't quite get Kronos down as they're just prepping for the assault in. But just like that, Demolish is going to take out Baizu and Shad immediately refrag back onto Demolish. It's Shad in a 1v3, and it's not going to matter because Kronos is going to take out Shad with the beautiful shot straight into Freezer. And Nuisance takes round number two. They can't quite get demolished as he's stuck here in the freezer. They've got him strapped from the skylight, but Rode is going to take out Devil. So Rode's coming up to play the support from White Stairs here. Demolish still being tracked, but you know that leaves Rode loose and Rode with the double kill onto Onyx into that cocktail bar balcony area. So reading door from Pillar is going to get a pre fire spray come out from. Kronos, but Shad's going to take out Vertigo on the, the flank as well, and that's just now Kronos against these two defenders, and he has he's going for the plant there, but they can't quite hear that plant they hear the plant going off, he's going to make the peak because his teammate's just not even covering and two more kills from Maslow as he takes out Baizu and Shad to win that round that should have been a fairly easy round, especially when they got in to get the plant off, but not sure kind of what happened there onto that heaven balcony window and onyx still just watching from red stairs while men's pursuing buys you opens up a vertigo with another c4 kill onto shad here's vertigo playing strong from the bathroom it's a very very early c4 kill straight across onto the bathroom he sees the peak gets the pre-fire off but vertigo trying to decide whether he wants to push it but he's not he's just going to rotate back into freezer there you go talking about that disciplined defense easy's gonna take out road though and it's now a 4v3 and this is the first time honestly that they look pretty weak maslow is gonna rotate out and just die though because he peeks the wrong angle on the way out and devil has the double kill vertigo is gonna take out onyx though and chronos is gonna take out devil and it's now a 2v2 is easy trying to make the long peak but vizu can't quite get it vertigo gets the triple kill and it's all up to vizu is vizu is gonna take out vertigo in the freezer it's now a 1v1 situation with a full health chrono but it doesn't matter as he gets a peek the push down onto red stairs is they know maslow is there but he just has that m10 and the call you know is going to come out maybe he's got a shotgun but maslow is going to take out ez on the rotate of the stairs and that's so be it down it is now a 4v4 they're trying to make some pushes that's maslow now all the way on the first floor what comes out Onyx gets on to demolish. Once prone and another kill from Onyx. He's having a great couple rounds. A double kill on this one. Onyx takes out Chrono. But doesn't matter as Baizu and Onyx are both going to go down from a good push from Maslow. That means they're going to fall off. And it's now up to Devil and Shad. Shad trying to make this play here. He sees smoke, but it doesn't matter because Vertigo is going to get him with that shotgun, the M590. And it's just up to Devil now in a 1v2. 49 seconds left, though, plenty to work with. His last Candela out. They're going to make the push. He's going to see him peek potentially here. He saw the head, can't quite get it off. Maslow just kind of seeing both players have the shotgun and just won't with SMG 11, but they do have the diffuser. He's going to make the push. He's going to get the one onto Vertigo as Devil gets a second kill for the round, but can't quite get the final. 
as Maslow gets yet another kill on the round as he clutches it for Nuzens. And that's 4-2 at the half for Nuzens. Maslow 9-2 coming in. Now, puts him in the 2v2, but they just have to be patient here as Vertigo's trying to use the Twitch drone to attack the player, maybe piss him off. Not quite sure. Onyx gets revenge, though, immediately onto Vertigo, and it's now 1v2, but now quickly turned into 1v1 as Kronos takes out Onyx from Nubalk to Heaven. Baizu's stuck in the freezer trying to figure out how exactly he wants to rotate around. With just 10 seconds left, Baizu peeks out in the bar. Not sure quite why. He's going to try to pre-fire it off. Baizu just needs to hide. That's all he needs to do. Doesn't matter. He's going to rotate it, and Kronos with the hit fire headshot onto Baizu as he's sitting on the floor. No idea what Baizu was saying about going prone there, but as you watch it come in right here, the final hip fire shot, the freak spray, saving grace for Nuzens.